Welcome to Object Oriented Programming Module 2. On the previous module, we have discussed the basic building blocks when it comes to Python programming. In this module, Module 2, we will be discussing class and object. We will also see the difference between functions and methods. To begin with, let's start by discussing class and object. Well, to create a class in Python, we use the keyword class. In our example, we created the class named my class, and it has a property named x, which has the value of pi. Now, when we have a class, we can use it in our object. We created an object named p1 in our example, as you can see, and then we used the class that we have created, my class. So we write p1 is equals to my class. And then we print p1.x, which is the property in the class, my class. Now let's try using um, class and object in Python. Okay, so again, we uh, create a class using the keyword class. And the name of the class, my class, colon, the property is x is equals to 10. Now we're going to create an object, the name of the object, so that we won't be, we will not be confused. We'll just use obj as the object is equals to my class, it's case sensitive, class function, and then we print, we use the object obj dot and then x okay so now we're going to run the program and then the output will be 10 because we called the value of x inside the class my class now let's try uh, using x again and this time the value is 20 but now x is outside the class and then we will print x and uh, let's see what the output will be. Run, and then the output is 10 and 20. The first output is the x inside the class, which we called through the object, and that's 10. And then the other output is 20, which is the x outside the class, and then we printed x. So that's why it's 20. Okay? Now, let's go to function. A function is a block of code to carry out a specific task. It contains its own scope and is called by name. All functions may contain zero. You can create a function with no argument at all or more than one arguments. On exit, a function can either return a value or uh, cannot return a value it's up to you now on our example you can see here uh, we have the function sum now in Python when we create a function we use the keyword def def and so on our example we use def and then the function sum and then the arguments we have two arguments num1 and num2 the return value is num1 plus num2 which is the sum of two numbers now let's try uh, creating a function our own function in python and so again we use the keyword def and then my sum we will use my sum as our, the name of the function the arguments are num1 and num2 just like our example a while ago and then we print print num1 comma plus num2 and then we call the function that we have created my sum and then the arguments will put 10 and 20 we run the, the program and the answer will be 30 that's 10 plus 20 is 30. Now we can also add here, just like what we have discussed on, our, on the previous module, we can add st string 
also on the print function so we print the sum from one end num2 is and then the two numbers num1 plus num2 we run the program we will have the, output. the sum of 10 and 20 is 30 you can also use the method that you the, the function that you created as many times as you like just like so we're going to use the function again this time we have three digits 234 plus 254 is 488 okay and so that is how you create function in Python okay now let's go to methods the definition of methods classes are used to create a user-defined data structure classes define functions called methods methods identify the behavior and action that an object created from the class and can perform with its data methods are functions defined inside the body of a class okay again methods are functions that is defined inside the body of a class a method in python is similar to function as what we have said a while ago these are functions inside a class what are the difference between the two two major differences the first one the method is implicitly used for an object for which is for which it is called second the method is accessible to data that is contained within the class now let's look at the example that we have we created a class which is hobby and then inside the class we created a function now if you create a function inside the class it will be a method okay remember a while ago a method is a function inside the class that's why we have the keyword def we use the keyword def when we create a function right but if we are going to create a function inside the class that will be a method uh, in our case we uh, use the uh, method my underscore method and then we print the return value is it will print I am a programmer and then below we created an object which is me is equals to hobby me is equals to hobby an object we assign the class and then me dot my method the object called the method inside the class let's try it on our own Python program okay so again we create a class and so the keyword is class hobby object okay now inside the class we create a method we use the keyword def just like creating a function def my underscore method all right now we have a method now inside the method we just print um, I I am a computer programmer all right okay okay now going to create an object We call the object we have the class and then we have the method now we're going to use both of them me that the name of the me is equals to the name of the class and then we're going to use me dot the name of the method inside the class which we had created my dot me dot my underscore method if we will run the program the output will be I am a programmer the uh, return value of the method in my method 
inside the class happy all right so don't be confused within the two with the two a uh, method is a function inside the class okay both of them method and functions are created using the keyword def the only difference is that a method is created inside a class okay and like a function methods are called on an object see like on our example we had uh, from the previous slide and also from the uh, Python program that we used my method is on the object hobby because the method is called on an object it can access it can access that data within it and like method which can alter the object state Python function does not do this and normally operates on it in short again a method is a function which belongs to an object okay and so that ends module 2 talking about class object methods and function thank you very much